Hello friends, welcome to Learn One. In previous lecture, we have learned about array data type in Ruby. And today we will learn about hashish data type in Ruby. Hashes are same as arrays. Arrays store its value by using index, while hashes store its values using key and value pair. So the main difference between array and hash is hash uses key value to store its values. We can store multiple objects of different different types to our hash. Hashes assigns value to its keys. So if I want to use some values for that I need to use it by using keys. So here in example you can see that I have created two hashes first hash and second hash. The first hash contains keys that are strings but the second hash that is contains symbols as a keys. So for hashes we can create hash with two types. We can add keys as a string and we can add keys as a symbols also. How to access elements of hash? For accessing elements in hash we need to access by using keys. For example here in my first example I want to use my value foo. For using foo value I need to pass its relevant key. Here in example the key is 1. So what I need to write is put s and my hash name that is first hash and I need to pass the key into the bracket that is 1 here in my example and it will return me my desired output that is foo. Suppose I want to access a second variable that is bar. I want to access bar value from my second hash. So for that what I need to do is I need to write my hash name that is last hash and also need to key related to that value bar. So here the key is 2 and it is symbol. So I need to pass that symbol into my brackets. So last hash and into the bracket I will pass a key that is 2 and it will return me a value bar. So this is how we can easily work with hashes. Now we will see practicals of hash. Let's create our first variable that is of data type hash. So our name would be first variable and we will create hash. So the key value pair that we need to generate. Our key is first and its value is 1. Let's create one another pair that is key is actually a second and its value is 2. Let me add third pair third and its value and this is how we can create hash. So our hash is ready. Now if we want to check its base class we can use class method first dot class and it will return its base class that is hash. Now I want to access its second pair that is its value is 2 and its key is second. So what I need to do is I need to write variable name and pass its key as argument and it will return the value of that key that is 2. So this is how we can work with hash. Now let's create one another hash that is having symbols as a keys. For example second variable and we will create symbols as their keys. For example 1 this is a key that is 2 and its value so to access its value 
for example i want to access this first element what i need to do is i need to pass its variables key actually here we are having symbol and it will return our variables value that is one hashes are also used to store different different data different different objects so let's create a third variable and this variable is having symbols as a key and its value is one two three let's create one another pair two and its value is learn one let's create one more that is third key value pair and its value is boolean let's also create fourth key value pair and its value is in decimal for example 456.23 and this is how we can create and hash with different objects and to access layer i want to access learn one so for that i need to put these two as a parameters and it will return learn one so this is how we can work with hash in ruby in next lecture we will learn about string data type in ruby